Tell me what led up to the UFO. What kind of things have people said they've seen here in the uh, in the San Luis Valley? Um, we had one gentleman who who was talking about how, and this was funny because we went to the cafe for breakfast, and he's sitting at a table with his nephews, and he turns to me and he says, "You're that lady that's going to put that thing up down there, huh?" And I said, "Yeah," and he said. Well, I got to tell you what I saw. And the nephews looked at him and their eyes got this big and he hadn't told any of the family about it. So anyway, he proceeded to tell me it was four o'clock in the morning. He was out changing his irrigation tubes and this bright light appeared and all the, the irrigation water went blood red. And then the light disappeared and the water was back to its normal color. So that's, that was kind of fun. Um, our UPS man, he's got a number of stories to tell, but he talks about how he and his nephew were driving along the highway and this spaceship appeared above him. And he said, if I would speed up, it would speed up. If I slowed down, it would slow down. And he says, finally, I just stopped. I got out of the truck and I yelled, do you want to make contact or what? And he said, it took off and went around the mountain, went around a bend in the mountain. So they thought that they had lost it, and so they, they continue going on the road, <laughs> and they go around the bend of the mountain, and there it is sitting there waiting for him. So, you know, <laughs> pretty bizarre stuff. One of the farmers was saying now he was driving down the road, and there was one in the field next to him. And, and again, if he would speed up, it would speed up. If he slowed down, it would slow down. He said, and this happened for about five miles, and all of a sudden it just took off. So, yeah, those are some of them. People talk about the strange lights and...